Well, it's a wet, miserable day in Wales. I've done an oil change, air filter, tightened my chain. I've gone right through the free ride. There's 14.5 hours on it now. And a parcel have just come through the door. Now, now you know we're into this night riding. And obviously you need lights. Now, this is Brad's light, which is uh, very good. Gives you a good flood, but it only lasts one hour. One hour on flat out and his battery's dead. Now I like to go out for at least three hours. So I'm just gonna show you the the uh, wisdom. This is the minus lamp system that they uh, sent me to try. And the spot on it is absolutely fantastic, but it's only a, a secondary light. Uh, there's not enough flood off it. So as long as you've got a good headlight on your handlebars or headlight on his headlight, when you put this in on your crash helmet, it's perfect for secondary light uh, the spot is like I said is absolutely tremendous so they sent me an email and basically said you've got the wrong light we're gonna send you a lamp 4 now this is a lamp 4a uh, I, well I think it is anyway so you will something that I miss it is so anyway just received it in a post so I've got to do an unboxing and a test uh, of this lamp now this basically has been designed for camping, fishing, shooting, mining, pretty much everything as well. A um, little note off the guy, absolutely great, we'll put that on the side, I'll read that later. And use the lamp system by you now. So, so it's a wisdom, and they're made in China, or Hong Kong, or something like that. Um, but you can buy them in the UK because there is a UK supplier now basically you can basically see the bits and bobs on it this is a, a lamp 4 uh, so the working modes are on there uh, they put it on the amount of time it will last now this has got a 13 hour on a medium and 5 hour on super bright 5 hours is more than enough for my night ride that'll be absolutely perfect like I said the 1 hours they're just not good to me um, so, well, let's have a little look what comes in this package. It's very well and nicely boxed. Um, Shamalina Dak Dak. Let's have a look at what sort of system we're getting in. Now, a lot of all the other mountain bike lights and all that on the market, like I said, they only last an hour. So, let's have a little look what we got here. Now, this is a complete kit. This is the lamp itself. Fully waterproof, uh, pretty much quite a nice size. I'm sure I can attach that to my armor somewhere. It's a uh, magnetic charging through a USB socket or a supercharger that comes along with it. Now these little lenses here, as if you can put them on um, to diffuse the lights a lot more. You can put them on push bikes for road uh, compliance obviously you can't have spots blinding people you can put these on to diffuse the lights we'll have a little look at them in a moment they there are other lamps they got a, another one for fishing um this is a super fast charger but uh charges the system up really quick there's an handlebar mount like the ones you get on all the mountain bikes so you know they're looking after you in that sense there's a headband if you're doing your camping and you're fishing well, there's loads of little bits and bobs in here. We'll have to go through all these. But I'll do them later. There's the rubbers. To put them on the handlebars. And here's your magnetic charger. Well, we've got a couple. A couple of chargers. Cool. Just to get... Oh, that's right. No, I did read up. But this will actually run your iPhone. If, you, um, if you're out and your battery goes flat on your iPhone, you can actually use... The, the light, the lamp, to um, power up your iPhone. So, like I said, this is the lamp 4, 4A actually. So, let's check that on it. You can see how easy it is for it to charge. If you're in a rush end, you can just pull it off and run. Um, pretty awesome. So, a quick look at the diffusers. 
diffusers just slip over. Oh yeah, they are clips on the side here for the diffusers to actually fit in little clips either side. So little clip on the top end for it to go on so it don't if it does fall off it doesn't lose it. Right, we're gonna have a look at the shining power on it. Now it haven't been charged yet, but I, I will be charging it. Obviously. So let's just go and have a quick look. Now they do come at least don't give me don't quote me on this, but I think they come like 50% charged. So let's take a little walk outside. We'll go around the side of the house. It isn't absolutely pitch black yet. But uh, this is, yeah, this should be all right for do a test. You can see a street light in the distance. So here's mode one, mode two, mode three. Now, it's a lot more of a flood off this. I don't know if you can see it on the, um, and then off. So you've got three modes. You've got mode one, mode two, and mode three. So the spot again is fantastic. You can see it lighting up all the trees. But there's a lot more of a flood off it. You can see the cool wall is flood lit now by you now, which is what I need. And then if you're riding your bike, that's a lot better than the the other lamp I had, which it just didn't give you enough flood. So yeah, that's pretty good. Now we'll have a quick look at some of the lenses, just to see what they do. Um, this is the first one I picked up. Yep. He's diffusing the light into more of a square, which might actually come in handy for night riding. Let's have a little look. Yeah, it's giving you a bit more of a spread, so uh, that could be more than adequate, actually. Now we'll check the other lights. Now this is the road legal one. Obviously, it's not going to blind everybody, but what you basically got with that now, you've got full spread. So this is probably great for camping, fishing, you know, bits and bobs. You can see now that's just totally flooding the whole area. Um, so that's a good work light, I suppose. Now this is the red light. Now this can go on the back of your bike, you know. And also then, it's good for other stuff like night ride, uh, night um, camping, when you don't really want to give your position away and you want to keep the light down to a reasonable state. So yeah, I... I just got to try it now i think this uh this lamp could fill all my needs let's have a go back to the original one now is the original one that's probably what i will use to ride but i will try out that one that spreads the beam into a square because I, I did find that was pretty good right then this is the lamp on charge and uh, you can see it tells you how much power is left in it as well so it's two thirds charged and obviously the last thirds going in and magnetic like I showed you and there's the socket going in here and I gotta be honest I just had a run around the garden making motorbike noises with my crash helmet on and it does feel good I can I, I can see 100% it's definitely better than the uh, that one which bit of a shame really but I'll, that'll probably become my work lamp or I might give it away in a in a prize uh, draw or something like that I don't know we'll do something with it but this is definitely took and replaced that so it's gonna be nice and light just checking my backpack and then one cable tie as you can see it is underneath my uh, helmet and yeah I'm looking forward to a ride I would go out for a ride now but it's raining and uh, it's time, 20 to 6, I would go out till about 10, but uh, I'm going to leave it till tomorrow now, because we did have a good weekend up the b -Seg. So uh, here it is then, it's the Wisdom, and I will give you the details of the guy who sent it to me at the end of the video. Someone's out on a motorbike. Nice. Anyway, this is it now mounted on my helmet. Here we go. Mounted on the helmet, and... That's pretty cool. Oh, I can't wait to get out now. It's a bit wet and miserable oh, tonight. Automatic drop, automatic flick up. Nice. 
Yep. With the headlight on the bike as well, I think that's going to be more than adequate. Here is the detail. Caplamps.co.uk And this is the people you can ring up. Obviously, mining, tunnelling and construction. Out of all the lamps and torches I have used, the quality on these is absolutely fantastic. And um, there you are. If you want one, give them a shout. Have a look at their range on uh, line. Shamalina Duck Duck.